Hey, we're back for some more Mario Maker. Checking out some new levels today. I haven't played Mario Maker in a little while, so a little bit rusty. Expecting a lot of death. Let's we'll see what we can do. So we got New Super Mario Brothers U, and we have Spike, Spike sort of, I don't know, shelled creatures. That uh, spin jump always helps me out, man. Always, always helps me out, but I'm a little bit rusty, guys, as I said, so um, I'm gonna go right. I don't know why. Okay, we got that. Dup -a -dup -a -dup. Ah! I did not actually miss that. Nice. Dup -a -dup -a -dup -a. I'm kind of curious to what I'm meant to be doing here. I have 86 seconds to... Oh! To get to my goal, though. Hey. That was cheeky. That was very cheeky, game. Oh, boy. Hey, what's up? Okay, the music suddenly stopped. I'm sort of really confused right now. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, I think there's another one. Oops. One, oops. One, two. Tie my shoe. Three, four on the floor. Five, six. Not really sure what the purpose of this is. Oh, it's putting them all together. Nice. I see. That was like a little training course, wasn't it? That's a jolly tune as well. Oh. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad, mate. I'll give you that one. It was a decent, decent level. But let's check out another one today. What do we got here? We got Diddy Kong's Crazy Course. I don't know why Diddy Kong would have a crazy course, but... Probably he does by Sapphire. I like that name. I like Sapphire as a name. I always thought if I had a child, I would call them such a weird name, you know? I would call, like, my son, like, Aurelius or something after Marcus Aurelius, the Roman Empire. I really like that name, but, you know, everyone probably would look at him and be like, <gasps> No! Oh, it's the, it's the DKC theme? I forgot about that, man. I always used to really enjoy playing Donkey Kong Country when I was younger. Probably one of my favorite games on the SNES. Although I didn't really pick up, uh... I really did not pick up... I did it again. Okay, let's see if I can make this jump. Uh, a lot of those games until later. Because uh, I think the first sort of game that I had... The game console, I should say. Ooh, you wanna jump? Uh, was... Nintendo 64, and I remember... Actually... Aw. Oh, oh, I remember trading away my, uh, oh man, what the hell, did he? That's a jolly theme, isn't it? I remember trading away my copy of Super Mario 64 for some sort of racing game. It wasn't actually a particularly good racing game either, because, um, you know, I, I don't know why. I, I, I thought, you know, Mario 64 was a bad game, and then I started to regret it, and I actually had to go and pick up another copy. So, do we have anything here for us, guys? Fire flower. Oh, got lucky there. Got lucky there. Big man Mario. Big man Mario. Oh, okay. I guess some other cool games that I had on the N64 were uh, F Zero. Was F Zero on? Yeah, I think there was. Yeah, yeah, there was. All right, I had some. What was it? Wave Racer. I can't remember. Oh. Looks like I'm just chilling here then. Although the one console that really got most of my attention was uh, the PS1. PS1 was my console back in the day. Like I don't know, I I, just, I played a lot of games on PS1, and uh, for me being younger, like Final Fantasy was my sort of go-to game. I have to I have to jump. Well, I think I know what I have to do. So I played a lot of Final Fantasy. I actually own every Final Fantasy on the PS1, even the you know. Uh, re-releases of the original games. I really wish they would spice up those boss fights a little bit. Because right now, they're really... Well, I guess I can't really hit on, you know, the original Mario. It is the original Mario, after all, guys. It's not as if it's some sort of, you know, awful, awful game, but... I guess that boss fight really hasn't... Uh, aged well? Is that the right term? Like, aged well? Maybe it has. Maybe it hasn't. Let's check out... Uh, 
Another couple here. Uh, Adventure 1 2 Root Underpass by Glue. Is that Mexico that he's from? I think this is the first Mexican uh, user I've seen on here. I always get world fly confused. It might sound really dumb, but I don't know. I always sort of uh, get them confused, oh, especially uh, Ireland and Ivory Coast. Like they're literally the same flag, except damn it, the colors are reversed. But then I think the Mexican flag kind of looks like Italy. Bop bop. I was actually just watching a uh, One Punch Man. And sadly, there's like freaking one episode left, man. I'm just so sad. I'm so, so sad recently because, like, I I, I had a sort of break from anime um, the past couple of years. I haven't really been watching anything. Nothing really held my interest except for, like, sequel series that I was watching pre prior to sort of... Um, prior to sort of not falling out... Or sorry, prior to sort of falling out from anime. Uh, but one, one Punch Man, honestly, is, like, one of the best series that I've watched... In terms of like shonen anime, if you get me, like, I didn't even know if you can classify it as like shonen. Shonen anime is basically anime. Uh, this target demographic is young, young children, you know, between the ages of like 12 and 18. Um, but at the same time, it's just one of those shows that I can appreciate. Uh, that looks. Mm, welcome to Super Mario Maker. Let's try that one out. It's one of those uh, that I can really appreciate, so. I don't know. He has very, like, weird eyes. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh, hey, what's up? What up? Okay, let's try and... Get something out of this one. Uh, do I need the spring? Yeah, Mario says, yeah. Doink. Why did I do that? Put it... Oh, I do, I do need that. Oh, I tried to time it perfectly, so I actually uh, used the... Not the Grand Pine, but I, I tried to time it perfectly so that I used the... I've lost my train of thought. Okay, here we go. This is it, guys. There we go. I need to grab that. Jump. I also was watching, uh, frick, I was talking about something and I forgot, anime, One Punch Man, yes. So really enjoying it, one episode left. Um, I sort of have been transitioning though, I've sort of been watching a lot of, you know, like reality, t not reality TV, I don't, <laughs> reality TV, <laughs> you'd never catch me watching that. Um, a water, looks pretty nice. Um, yeah, not a big fan of reality TV myself, but... I've been watching sort of a lot of sitcom series like uh, Always Sunny in Philadelphia and uh, stuff like, what do you call that one, Arrested Development that I'm watching right now. So really been enjoying that sort of uh, vibe. Oh boy. Oh crap. Oh, I'm dead. Didn't have enough time to think there. I think I know what I have to do now though. Ah, uh, nope. So in my head, right? Uh, uh, there's something up there I want to see. There's like a spur door. So when he goes, right? I'm jumping here. Yes, there we go. Uh, is there anything here that I can have? I'm not sure. I almost fell. I'm like a bird. I'll only fly away. Uh, hey, what's up? So what do I even do here? Man? I can't even get out. So what is... I don't get it. I don't get it. At all. Yikes. I like the way this pipe leads to nowhere. Oh, man. Let me try and think. Uh, I'll take the second... Or, sorry, the bottom one, but... It was something to do with that chest. Not the chest, the... Okay, this is what we need to be at right now. And the chain chomps are going nuts. Need to watch out for that because definitely uh hard to get past. I'm just gonna bolt and hope I get it. Somehow I managed to get past that. I like the way the pipes lead to nowhere though. 
Is it what? Okay. Hmm. Huh. You do get some very, very strange st st stages on here, really. But, you know, I guess that's just the way things go. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh. What? Hmm. Yes, I really connected with that one on a deep emotional level. Thank you for that. I do appreciate that. This looks like an interesting one. I love, again, I've always said I love the dungeon levels. Let's jump into the dungeon then. See what we can do. We got a bunch of bub bombs. Oh, I think I know what I have to do here. This is gonna be tough. Oh, what? Oh, I need to ride them. Oh, is that a Monty Mall? It is. Come this way, come this way. Can I get the jump on you? I don't want to hold on. Not enough. Not enough. So I assume I am essentially snookered. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I need to rethink this one. So yeah, I need to wait for them to turn. Okay, so half of them are going that way. You guys can just go. Meanwhile, I am going to watch Jingle All The Way reruns. Oh, crap. I'm almost... No! <sighs> so close. So close. But yeah, I'm, I'm not much of like a Christmas film sort of guy. Um, I guess. I don't know. I, I don't really get excited about Christmas anymore. I know like... Oh, Pyro the Grinch, or, you know, you're so stereotypical, Pyro, like, oh, I'm not getting excited about Christmas. What a guy. But, I don't know, I've never really sort of been a festive person. I mean, I guess I used to enjoy it when I was younger, because I got lots of presents and stuff, but even though I... I'm not really so materialistic, like, buying presents for people. Uh, bit annoying. I, I know people are like, oh, blah, blah, blah. But I, I don't really want anything, and I don't really want to buy anything, if that makes sense. Oh, Sugar, sorry, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> See, I try to keep the Mario videos PG-13, because uh, I know a lot of younger people watch them, so I look at the age demographic, and a lot of my older series are, you know, uh... Damn it. Mainly 18 to 24-year-olds, but for the Mario stuff that I do, a uh, little bit of a younger audience, you know, more towards uh, under 18, so... Apologies for my French. Oh my gosh. This is a very, very tough... ...level. There we go. There we got those Monty Moles I had really don't care for. And then I like the way they just drop the X. Drop the base. Pretty unique level. Pretty unique. I need to shut up. I need to shut up. I've been thinking of picking up uh, Star Wars Battlefront lately. I, I, I was over at my friend's house last week, and um, I was playing it, and a few of my friends recently got, well, two of my friends recently got PS4s. Okay, uh, hi. Okay. Hmm. I feel like this is an automated stage. Um... It is? Uh, is it? I don't know what it is. I feel like it is. Woo! I don't know what it is, is it? Let's do a little bit of a disco dance here. I messed it up, man. No, I didn't. We're still going. Oh, look at Yoshi. What a badass. Just, you know. Goodbye, Yoshi! Haha, <laughs> you can die. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Anyway. I'm going to end this one here, guys. A little bit of a shorter episode today, but, um... You know, with YouTube lately, I guess, I've just sort of been trying to dial it back a bit. I I know everyone... I will do this one. I know everyone likes, like, longer episodes and stuff, but I've just been burning myself out a lot lately with YouTube, making so many videos. And, uh... I'm going to try and just keep the episode length around 15 minutes for these, as I always... Oh, okay. Uh... But I want to play a lot of games, that's the thing. Um...
So I'm probably just going to try and keep my videos around 15 minutes, 20 minutes now. Um, I will try and get some of the editing back in, but ooh. I do like Steven Stone. I know this is a theme, by the way, but I just want to listen to it. See what it is. Uh, Champion Battle Steven Stone from Pokemon Emerald? Is it? Okay. Ooh, nice. I like that beer sound. One more Niagara down. Here we go. Oh, it's like a freaking course in itself. I don't know if I'm meant to be here. Ah! So that was like a little bit of a course in itself. That's kind of cool. I do like that. The way I've done that. Oh. I'll take this one. See if it's any different. Oh boy. It is. Oh crap. <laughs> That's funny. That is a good one. I like it, guys. I like it. Play the piano. Oh, we're up top now. I feel like this is where I was before, though. Okay, so I really needed this all along. Oh, boy, run. Oh, man, I'm dead. Tough. Really tough. Um... Let me try the middle. Let me try the middle one. I'll go down here. Let's see what we can do. What's next? Eggs tonight for my dinner. That's what Mario says, guys. So, hopefully, enjoy this one again. Um, just gonna be down on the back a little bit on the length of these videos because uh, I'm sort of exhausted by the end of the day and I really don't have much time to sort of focus on my own goals. Um, and I really want to make that a priority in 2016. So, hopefully, you guys don't mind a little bit more of the casual episodes and the shorter length. Uh, I'll try my best to get videos out consistently. And thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye.